Hello, Gary. Uh, my name is Robert Reed. I work with a lot of framers all over the United States. And uh, I was doing some research in your area and I came across your website and I figured you guys could use some help. So I made this video to give to you. And here are three tips that you can use and put into action to start beating your competition online with your uh, website. I didn't want to waste your time or waste my time either. So by the end of this video, if you like what you've heard, you can tell I have a lot of strategies to help grow your business. If it's something that you're looking for, give me a call and we can chat. If not, no harm, no foul. Feel free to take the tips that I've given you and use them for yourself. The three tips I'm going to give you today is content, citation, and backlinks. So the first topic is content. That's basically anything you can see on your front page, including the pictures. And what's behind the pictures are included in that content. And so why is content important? I'm sure you've heard the term content is king. You want to make sure that you have enough content on your page to clearly let Google know what it is that you do and what kind of services that you offer. Also, you want to make sure you have enough content that you're getting the keywords and key phrases worked into the content. So that way it reads naturally. You want to be sure that you're getting found for those keywords or key phrases that people may be searching for because so, someone is looking for your services but they may not have heard of your branding. So GWA would be your branding. And uh, this is definitely not enough keywords right here. Uh, you have to have at least 1,500. And they have to have keywords built into that that would have to do with what people would be searching for. Now, I know that you're we're doing a lot of work for builders. I was a builder at one time back in the day. And I was always looking for uh, framers. But people get busy, and if I was a home builder and I was looking for you, I would be Googling it and seeing who comes up. Well, um, they would be important to be ranking for, for the keywords that you have. So uh, I would suggest that you add more keywords onto this front page. And on the second tip I'm going to talk to you about a citation. So you may be asking yourself, what's a citation? And citation has to do with um, uh, uh, searching for certain areas. Like if I was looking for a framer in, um, in Vermont, then um, I would expect something to come up with maybe your name on it. First thing you're going to see on any normal Google search are the ads right here at the top. So if, you, if I went in here and, um, and let's see, if I was put in GWA construction. If I put in your uh, framers in Vermont, you don't come up at all. So, so up at the top here is all these Google, this is just your name on here. So a lot of people are uh, searching for framers and different things. So, so, so what a citation is, is especially your name, and your address and your phone number listed in various, various directories all throughout the web, like Yellow Pages, Facebook, Yelp, and some online profiles where business can put their information in. So, so what you do is, um, I've researched, we have a, a tool called AREFs, and in AREFs, we can put your uh, a site in there, and it gives you your ranking, and it also tells different things about your website that are really important that you need to know. Uh, the point eight is your domain rating across uh, Google. And uh, that's important to know because point eight is really, really low. Um, most of my websites are 30, 40, or 50 is what is here. And the backlinks are what you need to, to add to your website to make your domain rating go up. The backlinks um, are from one website referring back to your website. And referring domains is the is the different ones. Uh, these are all the people that are have uh, backlinks to your website. And they're all right there. And, you know, YP, that's yellowpages.com, uh, which has got a good domain rating. 
Yeah, so you're listed in some things, but not very many. So by looking at your um, website on in ARFs, the organic keywords are what you would be ranking for. Right now you're ranking for 18 uh, keywords. And um, so if you go in here, these are the keywords that you're ranking for. Uh, ver uh, construction companies, framing construction companies. And here's the position that's on your website. So anything below 10 is not a ranking at all. It's, it's all like on the third or fourth page. So even your name is still ranking back on the third or fourth page. So that needs to be improved. So, uh, so the, uh, we went over the backlinks. It's essential that another, essentially another website that's given a link back to your website, people, so people can find it. And not all backlinks are created equal. So if you go in here and you look at these keywords, uh, they they tell you how good they are. The backlinks is what I meant. So, um, for example, Pizza Hut, referring back to you, isn't, isn't going to be much ranking for you as a roofing contractor. From uh, The best thing you can have is one from a uh, uh, backlink from another state. So making sure that your relevant backlinks are relevant to your industry and your services that you offer will help you dominate your competition in the search engine. Um, Basically, looking through the pages, you can see that they have a quite a bit of content for other other contractors. So by adding backlinks onto this, we can make this website rank. So you'll be getting customers coming in that will be looking for framing contractors. So the days when the your builder doesn't have any, you'll still have backlinks, I mean, um, keywords, and traffic that'll be coming in that you'll need for leads. And these leads would cha change into paying customers. And you need paying customers to keep your business going. Unless you're just not interested in any more paying leads, then then this wouldn't apply to you at all. So, um, and the customers that would be coming through here with organic traffic would be customers that you could charge more because they're looking for a framing contractor. Sometimes these builders, like I was a builder, uh, um, try to get you down as cheap as you can possibly go. And they're always squeezing you because they got to make profit at the end for their house. So these people that are searching you on this website, on your website, would be coming through here. And they would be people that would be local projects like basement framing and, and stuff like that, that you would need in your off time and would also, you could uh, demand a higher price for because there's somebody that is just going to do it one time. And whereas a builder is doing it several times and would keep you busy, but their price would be lower than somebody that would be just doing it one time. And they just want to get it done. And somebody that's dependable, that's going to show up because if, uh, a lot of people that that are that are calling know that this is only one time deal, and sometimes they take advantage of it and don't show back up. So uh, that kind of gives you an idea of what we can do, and uh, you really need to get this website up and ranking, and um, we uh, can help you with that. Let me uh, get back to your website. So this website really needs to be uh, vamped up. And uh, it could really be a lead processor for you. So generating new leads and new paying customers. If you're interested in talking to us about this, I would be glad to sit down and have a phone call with you. Um, our number is 855-909-9544. And if you're not interested, that's okay. Uh, you just at least give us some feedback uh, and we'd be glad to... Uh, entertain anything you have to say. So thanks a lot. And I hope you have a great day.